door. I'm gonna count you down. You gotta be in there. And you need to have a microphone because you have to say done when you finish. They used to do that for Isaac racing, didn't they? Some type of Isaac racing? Oh yeah. I mean, yeah. Uh, it's no secret that tons of Condor was inspired and heavily taken from Isaac racing. <laughs> That's where we all started. We, in fact, tons of the people who started or were early into uh, Condor were from directly from the Isaac community. That's right. Mm hmm New Isaac at the end of the month. That's true. I'm, <laughs> I'm optimistic. Not gonna lie. I don't know why I'm optimistic. I have no reason to be optimistic. I frankly <laughs> should be like a battered dog at this moment <laughs> just like ah. <laughs> please no more please but for some like, reason i mean i don't know that uh whatever video it was where you're feeding your cat but you just keep pouring the food into the bowl and just never stops <laughs> and then the cat the cat's slowly like... backing up <laughs> <laughs> that that is exactly <laughs> right so funny. that is precisely the isaac dev cycle <laughs> just pour more on it Skawaga! How's it going? It's great to see you. Thank you so much for the 44 months. Wolf. It's good to see you, though. Appreciate you being here. We got the early... Uh, wow. Wow. I am, I am shocked, surprised, and a little bothered by what we just saw. There was uh, a base cat, a gold flail, and, of course, you start <laughs> with the dagger... And of those three items, the one we don't see is the one I anticipated both should take. So it was very interesting. It's happy to see they both got the uh, fortunate teleports, though, in that blood shop. True. Yeah. Uh, oh, wow. TNF has skipped 1-2 uh, and missed out on what is a very good weapon. So Obsidian Rapier for Hummingbee. That's fine. Axe is in black chest. That's true. Yep. <laughs> it's always. Uh oh. This is not oh, gonna this work. This is a problem. Yep. Yeah. Not just blood drum it. Uh, TNF. Stuck with a one damage flail into zone two. Are we gonna see? Because TNF's a pretty heavy favorite in this run as well. Hummingbee is great, but TNF has been throwing down this. Uh, this. Uh, TNF and honestly TNF and, and Ribbon Graph are the two heavy favorites I'd say um, we do already have Ribbon Graph out oh my gosh thank you flail <laughs> <laughs> yeah just batting all these enemies around <laughs> that is why flail was one of the best weapons early on when people were quite bad at this game because you could just get in the mix and then oh hey look hey there it is <laughs> oh <laughs> Reason number one, two, and three why the X is banned in Condor. <laughs> yep. Getting totally bailed out there. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I mean, TNF still doesn't have all the health, is still using their health boldly. Uh, do we wrangle this Minotaur? No, we're just going to money bomb it. Nice. Ooh, nice. And shovel <laughs> for sure. All right, that's a good shovel. A big dig. Plus one damage with their two damage axe. Very good. Coming be finding it too and getting a piercing on it. That's mm, very fast. That is good. Oh, that lineup. Did you see that? That was really <laughs> that's nice. some real good positioning there for Humming Bee. I'm going to say that that was some serendipity. A little <laughs> bit lucky on that one. <laughs> Maybe they meant to do that, but... Mm. And TNF also getting a not very good ring there. Ring of luck. Speaking of luck, there's a luck charm. Pride from the dead body of a leprechaun. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> this game's pretty dark when you think about it. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's not just flashy colors and cool music. Yeah. And frankly, it's not too bad compared to a lot of games. <laughs> to be honest. Ah. Hot 
equals. All right, look at this. We are on the same floor. Humming Bee is caught up. Humming Bee with the far superior ring. And look at this. We are high fiving now. And TNF wants to grab the the ear muffins. Humming Bee does not. Doesn't like muffins. Oh, but look at how those enemies evaporate with the ring of piercing for Humming Bee. Bomb that confused so up nice. trap for permanent confusion. <laughs> oh, that sounds epic. Oh, careful. Okay, just decided to go for it. Yeah, that uh, that clapper was poised. Also, uh, heavy plate in that shop. Just gonna skip it. Yeah, are we not going for that? Nah. Could probably do a one bomb kill, right? Yeah, five damage. I like that trapdoor mini boss hit on the same same beat. It's good. Mm -hmm. Feels good. All right, TNF definitely looking to charge back here. Humming bee. Oh, nice. Finding a potion. The TNF might not see that. They're going different directions. Yeah, zigged when they should have zagged. Now look out. Okay, I mean, look at that. Blast Helm pickup too. That was a pretty solid. Now did... Oh, TNF just grabbed the bombs and then left it. Wanted to keep yeah. the five damage. I think that's uh, not the right choice, but that's okay. We'll see how TNF handles it. I think that Blast Helm also has a lot of speed up advantage and... Three versus five damage isn't too big of a deal, especially with a move attack weapon like the axe. Yeah, not taking a lot of telemonkey grabs. When it's this close, is it worth the risk? And oh, if you're not busy. Oh, oh man, did you see the two neon telemages plus two telemonkeys uh, for TNF there? And uh, handled it very nicely, threaded the needle even, and TNF's ahead. There's where five damage helps. True. <laughs> yep. True. I take it all back. I... Uh, but good blood drum for humming bee. Ooh, this is a uh, full surround. <laughs> and actually, I don't know. Without the torch of foresight, is humming bee gonna see it? Yes, humming bee should see it. Yeah. Either screen watching or just that door opened from the skulls. Wow, this is a close race. I love this. They have a final sprint to the end here. Mm-hmm. Right, TNF with the lead. Let's take a talk take stock of their uh of their endgame build. I think we got our blood drum dead ringer kill, perhaps. And then uh, plenty of bombs, but the blast helm slightly faster for humming bee. Looks like we're gonna do, yeah, run up the middle blood drum. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, okay. We are at half a heart. That's bold. Uh, no oh. more blood drum now. We are at one heart for humming bee. Oh, oh my. <laughs> okay. Oh, Opting to this... go to half a heart, so both racers on optimal health coming into this final fight. Okay. Monk S. <laughs> Monk S is in chat, everyone. This is so sketchy. Nightmare first spawns. Oh, dad took the hit. Yeah, that's what you want. Keep getting dad beat up because you can't take any <laughs> hits. We got four hits now for TNF. One hit only for Humming Bee. But any moment could be the last. Oh, one wrong move. We got a dragon on the field. Oh. Red dragon? <laughs> and TNF is going to take it. But wow, what a fun race that was. A yeah, really good luring there for TNF at the end. Oh, the confused. Humming Bee. There's the dragon. It's not in a dragon. good spot. It's a... <laughs> 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 I just want to... Please clear it. Okay, nice job. Wow. That was fun. What a what a fun finish. And easily. Oh no, not easily. Uh is that dot fastest or is one behind dot fastest? That is dot fastest. It is dot fastest. So back to back fastest races, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Or at least in sets. I mean DNH had that dot fastest just before and now TNF crazy crazy cool we're gonna be going off once more
Well, if you're gonna bring your best, it's good time to do it. Yeah. Oh, Look that's, to see all these dot fastests. That's funny. Hummingbees would have been a dot fastest best as well, if not for TNF. So it was the two fastest oh, the runs worst. so far in this <laughs> conduit. Yeah. It's like I think it was Maya got like way back in the day got like a sub six in a condor race, but so did their opponent and lost. <laughs> Oh no. It's like the fastest <laughs> condor race ever and both racers got like sub sixes or something like that. That was in Caligor? Who am I thinking of? What's going on? I need more context. I don't remember the I just have vague images of things. I'm like a very bad mind reader. <laughs> like I vaguely see something. <laughs> you had a mother and a father. <laughs> I see someone with the name that starts with the letter G B H. <laughs> one of them. It was a consonant, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> but if it wasn't a consonant, it was probably a vowel. <laughs> <laughs> you lost a monster with a sub six and Condor X? Oh my gosh. Yeah, it was Maya Inc. is what I was thinking of, but that's oof. Okay, Shrine of Uncertainty, but we are now certain that it is bad. It was a uh, bow, which means uh, no one's going to do anything with that shrine because TNF's already passed it. But if you die or restart, you'll want to bomb that shrine for the ring. There's a potion here, too, for TNF or vault. True. Could be a vault. I kind of hope it's a vault. It's just way <laughs> more exciting. There is something that's stompy. Is that a dragon? Yes, it is. Got to get oh, on the other side of that balance. vault. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, we got bombs here. This is probably just bomb. If it's a vault, though, yeah. this is going to be a party. <laughs> there it is. I think we're trying to get the dragon to... Okay, yeah. Oh, nice. With the two damage. Uh, Hummingbee with this... Uh, uh. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> okay. That was a ring of... There's a ring of pain... Yeah, that was okay. So the skeleton shut the door there on Hummingbee, and Hummingbee had to tank the bomb. But with this restart, you could go for the the ring that's in the mystery shrine. But I mean, TNF already has a pretty good ring, so imagine just want to go for that one, or just catch back up. I don't know. No, that's a good option. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> true. Bomb it. Do it. I assume that's not the food shop, because... Yeah, that would have been a good value. That would have been a good value bomb. All right, what's <laughs> the ring, everybody? Not peace. It's might. Not gold. It's might. I, I think oh, it's nice. might or um, war. Definitely plus one damage. It looked like that was a knockback on this. I don't know if the skeleton corpse actually does get knocked back like that or not. We will find out in a second. It's war. Four. Nice. Cool. What is it good for? Plus one damage and not back. <laughs> Say it again, <laughs> y'all. <laughs> oh, nice. Taking that mon monkey. That's fun. Ooh, TNF taking a hit, breaking their glass slippies. Oh, wow. That was a very busy nightmare. <laughs> yeah. He disappears and there's like six enemies underneath. <laughs> okay. So Hummingbee has a bit of a situation here. Needs to catch up. This is a do or die for their tournament. So we, so we have glass harp in black chest. Uh, I believe that is correct. So probably just... I don't even know. I guess you got to take it. You need the damage up. I don't know where that dagger phasing came from. Unfortunately, it, for TNF, you kind of do three damage with this build, but not when you throw it at the... It's kind of one of those weird, janky, not actually three damage, bring a pain situations. Oh, but that's good. The holstered dagger of phasing, too? Oh, wonderful. Mm. 
Nice. How does that even work? Why doesn't the phasing just fall through your holster? <laughs> I don't know. Like, why doesn't it fall through your hand? That's true, too. <laughs> Nothing about this game makes any sense. I'm going to have to do an expose on the next Condor News. <laughs> Nothing makes sense. <laughs> Special edition of Condor News. We're going to you know, break down why this game doesn't make any sense. Well, <laughs> oh, here we go. This is a little sketchy for Hummingbee. I had to back down a little bit. TNF with that excellent heavy plate find on what, 3 1, oh, 3 2? I missed that. Yeah, that's good. Mm -mm, thank you, oh, nice Fire Elemental. Trap. <laughs> Ooh, this is fun. Well, this is. All right. We, we're alive. Thank you, heavy plate. Yeah. Ah! What's in there? We want to know. Okay. Ooh, shield spell. Hello. And a uh, ring of ring of war with this is pretty good knockback too for Hummingbee. Hummingbee also having that torch, so mapping is the same, but Hummingbee went the wrong way. I guess that's possible with just torch of walls on zone three. Yeah, sometimes the exit cluster on the map kind of looks similar to the rest of it. <laughs> yeah. But here it's pretty obvious which way to go. Oh yeah, that's exactly what TNF needs to do, Monster Racer. <laughs> you, you throw the phasing dagger at your boss room mm -hmm. and then unholster your rapier. Yep. Hope for a warlock. <laughs> yeah, this is the time. There's like always a... Isn't there like a warlock in every room? Something like that. Sure. I think there's one in every room. There was one in the first room. There's one in this room. I'm paying attention now. <laughs> uh, Nightmare probably stomped the... Uh, yeah, yeah. There was the, definitely mm -hmm. one in that boss room. It was just stomped <laughs> on. Yeah. <laughs> the teleport. Nice. Yeah, there wasn't one there either. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I might be wrong. <laughs> That was a good zone four there for TNF. And Hummingbee's also keeping it pretty close. But uh, it doesn't seem to be quite catching up because of how good that zone four was for TNF. And getting a blast home out of a red chest check. Love to see that. Mm-hmm. Getting bailed. Five damage lunge with the pain. Very nice. Ooh, the double fireball. Well, we have potion styles like this is kind of scary, but <laughs> that was a bold choice. Oh, oh no! Wait, what happened there? Is that the rapier pixie bug, or did they just? Yeah, they just stabbed it. That's not. That's yeah. It's no good. No, that doesn't bode well for your health. Ooh. The phasing poke and throw. A classic. Oh, you can do that with Necker Dancer too. You can throw him off the stage. Yeah, do it. Do <laughs> it. Do it. Bomb up the right side and then run around to the left side and then throw him off the stage. <laughs> and with the holster, you can even bring the loot with you. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> so you don't even have to go then back to get the loot. Do it. Come on. Uh, you gotta take the dagger. Uh, I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> yeah. It looks like they're just charging their uh, shield spell there for a little bit. Yeah. Sadness. Uh, for anyone who, who might not know, you can actually, uh, you get extended shield for um, the Necrodancer fight. For the sheer fact that there is two songs in the Necrodancer fight, but the game does not differentiate the number of beats in the song, so... By the time you light it up, if you haven't started the second phase yet, it will tell you like, oh, end this on beat 35. And then you hit them and it starts the song back over on beat one. So then you get like an extra long, like 35 plus, what is it, eight or something? It's good. All right, GG's. We've got our finals set.
and what Let's a finals it's gonna to be here yeah dnh versus tnf we're doing it everybody we've got the three letter racers <laughs> This is gonna be good. I watched their race in the, um, in the regular season, and it was entertaining to say the least. Uh, TNF winning two to one against DNH.